there is a very interesting session which is coming up next and that is technologies driving customer convenience in banking and to speak more on that i shall now invite milin nagno to please come on stage milin nagno chief technology officer kotak mahindra bank ladies and gentlemen can we have a huge round of applause for him please thank you good afternoon everyone so i'll keep it light i'll share a few stories uh, keep it fun and uh, I'll share an hypothesis after that, and then we'll be done in about ten minutes or so, because I know I'm in between uh, all of you and lunch. So the year was 1996. The location was the computer uh, lab at the mechanical engineering department at IIT Bombay, and there was a bunch of kids there sitting on computers applying to U.S. universities. the previous batches and seniors had to print out the forms had to do typing printing binding etc send their applications uh, and i could see the joy in the eyes of my classmates when they were sitting on the computer using the lynx browser at that time uh, netscape had just come in uh, around 1995 but we were still using the command line lynx browser and connecting to university sites and submitting applications online so technology bringing convenience uh, in our lives that was an early glimpse of that and then in 2007 2008 as you know iphone came out and completely changed the landscape of how we go about our day to day activities following the the growth of the iphone and the smartphone uh, then came the whole app ecosystem and as bfsi leaders we all know how much digital banking has now become the primary channel the largest number of transactions today digital is our largest branch in most of the banks as you know largest number of transactions happen through the digital channel however uh, there is a gap that has been developed in the customer experience of consumer apps and banking apps uh, the amazons of the world you know the experience that you have uh, on apple google amazon even uber uh, is is way different than the experience that we have as consumers on the banking applications and my hypothesis here that i'm going to present is that because uh, we have prioritized and mostly focused on functional features without paying attention to the non functional areas by non functional areas i mean the resiliency the performance uh the stability the scalability of the design and the inputs required to get these things right for example four nines of availability means or 99.99% availability means that you have no more than 5 minutes of downtime in any given month across planned and unplanned work that you do on your applications and some of the consumer applications tech from tech companies do not even have that 5 minutes of time downtime every month uh, because they have mastered the art of non functional requirements you know in terms of how do you deploy how do you design and architect the core platforms what and this all comes from a core engineering mindset that is applied at every stack you know from infrastructure to software engineering to tech tech ops and devops so therefore the hypothesis here is uh, if us as banks have to come to the same level of excellence in terms of customer experience as the consumer apps that we use we have to pay attention a lot more to the non functional requirements uh, or at least as as much attention to the non functional requirements as uh the features that we keep running after uh i feel that as an industry we keep running after oh this app has 100 features my how can my app has only 99 features you know how, how can i have 110 features right and in that push to do so uh we we forget the basic sometimes so therefore at kotak mahindra bank our technology strategy is deeply anchored on the 4s philosophy you know which is speed stability scalability 
and security of our applications. And we are transforming our technology workforce into core engineering work workforce, where we are bringing a lot of engineering in-house. Uh, we are focusing on goals like four nines of availability for our key applications. Uh, and therefore, uh, I'm going to proceed ahead on the hypothesis that in order to get to the same level of customer convenience and customer experience, uh, as the consumer apps and, and tech, tech company apps, uh, we as an industry have to focus a lot more on the non-functional requirements. So in our company, there is another equation that we follow, which is in today's world, CX equal to TX, uh, which means that customer experience today is nothing but technology experience. So I will leave you with that thought. And as, as promised, I will keep it short and sweet. And uh, uh, thank you for having me today.